Here we're being shown a Maxwell-Boltzmann distribution curve with the number of molecules with a given energy on the y-axis and amount of energy on the x-axis. The question is asking us what the total area under the distribution curve represents. Is it A, the total energy? No, that's not the case, because what we're showing is we're showing how many molecules have a particular energy. So here, this is the number of molecules that have got this much energy. Is it the activation energy? No, that would be a particular point on the x-axis, say, picking at random here. The total number of reacting molecules. That's a tricky decoy here because it's not the number of reacting molecules. The reacting molecules will be these to the right hand side of the activation energy that I drew and those are the ones that will react. So this is the area under the curve past the activation energy, which means D must be correct. The total area under the curve, so the entirety of this graph, is representative of the total number of molecules present.